All right, uh, we're doing a little bit of work with uh, color correction using After Effects, and we're gonna warm up the color inside of an image. Let's go and let's take a look. So all of these are one package we already talked about. I go to File, Import, File. It's inside a folder called Repair Video. It's one of the sample folders that's in your folder uh, on the Canvas shell. So we want to take the uh, video file Sunburst Trees import. We're going to make a new composition from it by clicking and dragging it down to the new composition window. And so we've got some footage here, some uh, really nice uh, lights coming through the trees. We've got the green, we've got the blue. And uh, what we want to do is we want to just make this a little bit warmer. So with this selected, we're going to pull up the Lumetri color. I can do it by finding it over on the right under effects and presets. I can also go under effects, go down to color correction, find Lumetri color, click, pop it out, go to basic correction. In this case, the exposure and the contrast look pretty good. Uh, so we're going to work with white balance. So I can collapse and expand that. If uh, um, there was something in the picture that I knew was supposed to be white, I could grab the white balance selected, the eyedropper, and click on it and set the whiteness. And you can also do this if there's a color that's neutral gray. What we're going to do instead is look at the temperature. So the temperature is going to make an image cooler or warmer. So I drag it to the left. You'll see the image getting cooler. If I drag it to the right, you'll see the image getting warmer. So I'm going to drag it to about 100. And you can see that it's much warmer now. Now, what is the tint? The tint is a shift from a green to magenta. So if I grab that tint and drag it to the left, you'll see the image getting greener and greener and greener. I drag it to the right, more magenta. And what we want to do in this case is we want to make the picture look a little bit warmer, like maybe it's right at, at the setting of the sun. And so now what I've done here is I've set the temperature to 100 and the tint to 23. And what we have is a, a much warmer shot. And we used Lumetri, just a basic, correction tab in Lumetri to modify the color. So sometimes there's something wrong with an image and then sometimes you simply want an affectation, a, a artistic affectation to the color. And nowadays there are jobs where all people do is, is color, uh, are colorists and they go in and they, they color uh, films. And lots of times when you see a film, a film will have a palette. And lots of times, uh, the, the expensive films, they'll have a three color palette. Maybe it's teal, orange and gray, or green and brown and blue. And you'll see those colors repeated over and over and over again. One good example of this is Atomic Blonde. that had a very uh, refined palette. It was a lot of uh, neon, a lot of blue, a lot of purple. Um, and so lots of times when you're looking at a film, you can actually see that they've gone in and they have very carefully crafted a palette for that film. Let's stop there.